is TFNN. The Tiger Financial News Network. TFNN Headline News Update. Good morning, everyone. Basil Chapman here on this February the 8th, Wednesday. This is the uh, Tiger Financial News Network 10 a.m. market update. Dow's down 13 at 34,138. Oh, it's up 21 right now. Starting to move quite nicely. We're looking for a leg D in the Chapman Wave methodology. That would go over the 34,000. What was that? 34,003 something or other. 34,000. Uh, 334 level that was made about six sessions ago. That'll start a leg D. It's been a little bit of a struggle, but you've got the rectangle in the uh, pattern in the weekly chart looking at the S&P. SPX, there we go, the S&P right now, trading down 15. Actually, it's down 0.37%. Dow's only down 0.10%. As I said last week, the Dow's correction should be completed, and now the Dow should become a leader doesn't mean to say it's going to charge out of the box, but it should be more of a leader than the other indices. And we're looking at the S&P uh, needing to get to 4195.45 to go to that leg missing leg D. Uh, we're at 4148 right now, down 16. Look at the QQQ, uh, down 0.74 percent. That's down 226 at 307.50. Uh, we're looking at that's also a little bit of a struggle to get to 313.39 to get to a leg D. We're looking at uh, the IWM, that's the Russell Small Caps, holding uh, a little bit better, down 0.42%. That's minus 84 at 194.74. So far, the, the small caps are holding pretty well. If during the rest of this week, uh, that's Wednesday, the rest of this week they can get to at least 197, they're at 194 right now, that'll be a good sign. Now, this is going to be very interesting. Why? Gold had a bit of a rally earlier on. Now it's down just a fraction at 1884. The whole pattern itself says well, the gold has had a pretty good zonk to the downside. Now it has to try to repair that damage. But if it starts to trade, instead of being at 1884 right now, by Friday or Monday, this Friday, coming Friday or, the, or Monday of next week, it's down in the eight. 1863 area, that's going to be a problem. Uh, the dollar is trying to rally a little bit further. What we are looking at here is that the crude oil, uh, the crude oil has had a very nice rally. It's up 82 cents. I'll be back for the Tiger Technicians Hour. Check out my opening call daily newsletter. Uh, this is going to be a very interesting session coming up. There's a lot to discuss going into next week. I'll be back in a moment.